Based on offset is perhaps one of the easiest and most durable techniques that we have. All you require is two tapes, at least one peg, and either graph paper or a piece of blank paper. What you then do is you'll be recording at right angles from objects or structures down to the baseline. To start the baseline offset, the first thing you have to do is actually set up the baseline. So you need a tape such as an open reel 30, 50 meter tape, just to give you a little bit of extra to play with. You need to consider how far the tape needs to go and what things you need to measure off the baseline. So first up, we put a peg in so that it stays firm. We then extend the tape outwards. Now one of the considerations is how you're going to align the tape. You can either make sure it aligns to, for instance, a north-south or east-west, or if you're not going to align it along a cardinal direction, then you need to record what that direction is that you've actually done. Once you have the tape set, peg in the far end so that the tape does not move from this point, so the baseline remains fixed. The second stage is to take measurements from the object or the feature or the structure to the baseline. Now this is critical. You always do your measurement from the structure, feature, object to the baseline, not the other way around. So the zero point of the tape must go onto the feature. We extend the tape, you can use a cloth tape or you can use a metal tape. We then, to get a right angle, we pass the tape in an arc over the baseline until we get the shortest distance. Once you have the shortest distance, that represents a right angle. You then have to take two measurements. One is the distance along the baseline. So in this case, it's one meter 22, and then there is the distance from the point. In this case, one meter 33. Once you've recorded that, you then need to do all of the other points that you are recording. 